All right, let's find out what is in this wall in the sewers. Hopefully, it's a good thing for Lee, and it gets me out of the sewers. Kind of curious. What the hell? Must have been one of those old nuclear fallout shelters. Wonder if someone's living down here. Look at all this. It's enough to keep people alive for months. This is good. Wonder if there's anything I can take with me back to everybody. Who are you? It's all right. It's okay. I, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here... Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. He came here with a small group hoping to find a boat. We just want to get out of here. How about you just let me go? Ain't no boats around here. Crawford took everything. Yeah, I heard. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. Look, I don't want to do this. Let's talk, okay? What's to talk about? You won't even tell us who you are. My name is Lee. I'm a history professor. And I don't want to die today. And I don't think you want to kill me either. Don't. Don't come any closer. Or I'll shoot. Come on. Let's just talk about this. Vernon, what are you doing? Shoot him! Nobody needs to get shot. Just take it easy. Grab the gun. It's all right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Vernon! Relax. I'm not here to hurt you. You're really not from Crawford? No. I'm really not. Well, we are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place, you know, started weeding out the sick and the old so the perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here at the hospital. We're in remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? A morgue? Yeah. Irony's always high on my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. How did you find your way down here? A few of us got boxed in by walkers up on the street. Came down here trying to get away. Now I just want to get out of here and get back to my own people. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Those sewers are like a damn maze. Any chance you could help me find my way back? Look, I'd like to help you, but we've all got our own problems. Two of our group are sick and need constant care, and I'm the only doctor here. Besides, why should we help you? Wow. Look, I'm sorry if I scared you. I just want to get back to my people. Back to Clementine. She's your daughter? No. She lost her real parents. I'm doing what I can. You're not seriously considering going with him. It's all right, Bree. I had a daughter, too. Lost her in the first days. I'll be damned if I'll just sit back and let that happen to someone else. We need you here. Don't worry. I'll be back before you know it. Let's go.
Figured this was a smart thing to do. He knows these sewers take, you know, can take me anywhere around town. He probably knows how to get back. So I'm all about it. Seems pretty cool. Anyway, he's a doctor. Couldn't shoot me. All right, let's see if I get back finally. Trophy. Clementine? Clem? Molly? Oh, hey, you made it back. Who's this? He didn't tell you about me? Understandable, I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back at the river. Who's the fossil? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. He helped me get back here after we got separated. I think you have something that belongs to me. Lee, thank God you're back. Krista, what's wrong? It's Omid. He's gotten worse. Much worse. We have a man wounded. Who's this? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? You have to help us. Please. I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. Omid, honey, you're gonna be all right. Lee brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. Clementine? Clementine? Yeah, where is she? I thought she'd run up when she heard my voice. Clementine, you in here? Where is she? Hmm. Oh, a drawing. Clem, you in here? drawings but where is she that's actually adorable she drew a picture of Lee Clementine all right obviously not in this room so could make like a bread truck and haul buns out of this room unless the couch I'll have time to rest later. Nope. All right. So, can we look out the window at all? No, I guess there's just these rooms. Let's see what's over here. Clementine, you here? Hello? What are you doing? Oh, you know, just poking around. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. Where's Clementine? Don't ask me, I'm not her keeper. Hey, do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Why don't you go bug them? Okay, thanks. That was actually quite helpful. Now she has me wondering, did we miss something? Molly? I told you, that girl isn't with me. 
Go ask your buddies and quit bothering me. Jeez. I don't care about that. I just want to find Clementine. Alright, then I'm going to make you look at this. I'm just kidding. Gosh, I, I don't know. I think Molly's kind of rude, but at the same time, if you haven't talked to people in a long time, you're going to lose your social skills. All right, let's look outside. Don't see her out there. She's got to be downstairs. Clementine, you up there? Shit, where could she be? With all this yelling that I'm Clem? doing. Clementine? She's got to be somewhere around here. Clementine, come out, please! Kenny? Oh, hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. You want to throw down again like back on the train? Because I fight better when I'm shit-faced. Kenny, come on. Give me that. Kenny, give me the damn bottle. Get the fuck away from me. Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked. Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us. That crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink... They have no idea where Clementine is, I bet. Have either of you seen Clementine? Damned if I am if I know. Gotta be around here somewhere. Ben, I gave you one job when I left here. Take care of Clementine. Then she shows up out on River Street looking for me. What the hell happened? Hey, don't put all that on me. Omid took a turn for the worse, and Krista asked me to help. I'm sorry, I'm doing the best I can here. She was frantic, and things got kind of crazy. I told Clementine to stay put. What else could I do? It's okay. I'm not mad at you. I just want to know where she is. I think she went out to play in the backyard. On her own? With no one watching her? Man, will you get off my back? She's fine out there. She better be or it's your ass. Okay, let me get this straight. Ben thinks that it is okay in the middle of a zombie apocalypse for a kid to be playing outside when there's already been a creeper who's come up to us. Whatever. Trophy! Clementine? Clementine! Not in there. Where could she be? She in the doghouse? No pun intended. Hmm. Is she in the shed? Doors covered in mud. Don't think anyone came in through there. What's banging on the door? Clementine. Hey, girl. Come look. Look what I found. Cliffhanger. All right, we're going to have to wait for the next episode to see exactly what is in this shed right now. 
Um, but anyway, thanks for watching, you guys. I sure do appreciate it. More of this to come later on, of course. So make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, all that great jazz. Just make sure you check the description below. Don't forget the live stream, June 1st uh, into the 2nd, to benefit the charity water.org right here on this channel with Tezzadude and myself. But thanks again, you guys. I sure do appreciate it. And as always, I hope you have a good one.